Uh, hello and welcome to another episode of uh, Rusty Lake Roots. We're continuing with the third branching path here, which I think will probably be the last one. Uh, 1885 masks. Which mask do you want? You want a butterfly. Well, I've got the blue mask. If you want a butterfly to come in, that's probably the best way to get there. Um, two pipes, not sure why. A watering can. They're both locked. Now, where do I get the butterfly from? Do I give him the blue mask? The blue mask makes it rain outside. Now I have a watering can full of water. Which, if I put through the drain, gives me a key, apparently. Uh, which then gives me the hockey mask, which then does what? Makes it very cold outside. So now I get an icicle. Do I put the icicle in this pipe? Like. And then apparently that makes somehow we get a key out there for that. Which gives me a it's not a binocular, it is definitely a telescope. Um can I use the telescope to find the butterfly? Um There's a the hotel. I don't know how to Oh, hold on. Are there any symbols hidden? Let's have a look when it's raining. Because I'm seeing suspicion that something is going to change it a bit. Uh, don't see anything yet. Mr. Crow. A U with a line through it and a triangle with a dot next to it. Okay, well, I've done... It looks like that, not like that one. And I'm assuming if I put the hockey mask on, uh, because the weather changes again, I will see another shadowy monster. I think that's supposed to be Mr. Crow. Uh, pin pointing downwards and a triangle facing that way. To the moon and back, the moon mask. What is the moon mask going to do? Um, hello? Two, three, one. Five, two, three, one. This? Ah. Who is that, I wonder? Um. And I get a butterfly. That feels odd to me. Can I close the window again? Can I take the mask back off? Because that's kind of freaky. Can't close the window. Um, great, he killed the butterfly. Thank you, Albert, for your mysticism. The Lying Game. Mary Ida Samuel and Albert. The High Priestess always tells the truth, the Devil always lies, the Chariot lies only once, the Empress tells the truth only once. Look outside. Oh, I can't do that at the moment. I want to look at the table, not the... Emma Vanderboom found dead, instant at the Rusty Lake Hotel. Can I do anything with the painting? Well, there was a key in it, apparently. And this is the marriage photo. The marriage wedding photo. That's the one. Samuel, Emma, and Albert. Well, I can open this now, at least. The devil. Oh, goody. What's this one say? My sister died. The locker code starts with 37. Keys in by the bottom right corner of the page. So you've told the truth at least once. My sister died. No. 
Yes. Because Emma's not here. You told the truth more than once. The High Priestess always tells the truth. You're either the High Priestess or the Chariot. Because um, we don't know about the locker code yet. A key is hidden under the newspaper. The devil has my photo in his pockets. Ends with 46. So it's 3746, the locker code. Uh, 37... Four and six. No, so one of them is lying. If you're the devil, that's a lie. That's a lie. Right of the painting. I mean, technically not lie, it was in here. Was there one under the... the... There's nothing under the newspaper. So you did lie. Because there's no key under the newspaper. That's true. The key is... It's truth and two lies. Um... You are the devil, aren't you? Um, a key is hidden. That's a lie. That's true. And that's. I'm assuming you're the high priestess. By the top left corner of the photo. That's true. The locker code ends with 94. I'm assuming that's also going to be true. 94. That is true. So you have told three truths. Can't no back out of that. Um Which means, oh, no, you're the High Priestess. I th think you're the Empress and you're the Chariot. Let's look outside. Well, I got it right, I suppose. Um, do I give you this? Of course I do. Uh, next, voodoo. What are you actually, what are you thinking? Uh, you want the eyes. Well, I'm assuming that's what this one's for then. He wants a screamy mask. Can I use this to light this? I can. Um, and these are some different facial expressions. Um, does the candle burn? I have a burny candle. they want to be spooked like he is on fire and doing that open eyes open mouth that's not those what happens if I set her on fire. Will you let me do that? No. 
do it, can I pick this up? There's a key in this. So I open this up. And I stab you with a pin, I suppose. How does that work? Um... Do that. Um... T pose for dominance. What if I make them both T pose? Well, she should already be dead because she's had a spear shoved through one of her boobs, apparently. Um, will that change anything? Can't go any further. Uh, so left arm down, right arm up. If I invert them and do the other way round, what happens if I put them do the same? Eyes closed, mouth open. I'm not sure who I'm supposed to be following, so I'm going to go with her. Um, then I'm going to make her... Okay, I think I'm following what needs to be done. What happens if she T-poses? Eyes open, mouth... Straight, yeah. And what's the other one? Left arm out, right arm down. Okay. Closed, everything closed. Scissors. Does he want the scissors? Oh, woohoo. Um, they got an achievement for getting the eyes, and they go in the jars, I suppose. Got an eye in a jar. And finally got. So, how many. I'm just double checking quickly how many achievements we actually still have left. So, that was six. We still got ten to go. Okay, then. Interesting. Uh, we'll move on to the next one The Brood. Uh, bean drop. Oh. Oh, it's a pipe puzzle. Oh, this is going to be easy. Egg. Egg? And potato. So, egg first, then a drop. And that has to go in this bit? I mean, I like pipe puzzles, but this feels a bit ridiculous. That's pointless because it's the same either way you put it. Um, this isn't. Um. That does appear to be going the wrong way, so let's just do that. What 
What do I do with the... Does the potato go in? What do I do with the potato? I get some flints. Can I use those to make this... Great, but I need... A drop of something, apparently, first. He wants the jar. Oh. I see. Uh, let's do that and that, and then that has to go in there. Wonderful. Um... Not quite sure what's supposed to be happening. Um, can't click on you anymore. The growth went in there. Why is it not? Is it because they're coming in from the wrong sides? Like, does the water have to come in from this side? Or something? But I don't quite know how to accomplish that. Um, I know how to, that simp, oh, hold on, I got it, I think. Yeah, and that somehow made baby. Um, fall of 1990 rose. Um, William turns into evil person. I'm gonna... Okay, so clearly this is to move forward with the story. We've got to say yes. Knowing these games, they've probably hidden something in here. Um, Rusty Lake, maybe? Um, where's the L? Rusty Lake. No? Cube escape? They have to have hidden something in here because it, it's just such like the perfect place to hide something. Because last time they let us input things into a typewriter, they hid something, didn't they? Can you hear me? Can you move her hand there? Can you hear me? What is your first what name? What is your first name? What is your first name? Cube escape. I don't know. I don't... Feels like that did nothing, so I'm going to move on. Uh, name. I'm guessing it's William. Because Aldous doesn't seem to do anything, so I'm going to say William. I assume they would have hidden something here, but I don't know what I could put in. Chrome? Does Chrome work? That did something last time, but I feel like they wouldn't just reuse the same one. Um. Nope.
William. What is your last name? What is your last name? What is your last name? Vanderboom. I know that one. I would, still wouldn't be surprised if there is something here I'm missing. Oh well. Do you want my key? No. Yes? Am I just a... Um, canonically, am I just a ghost this entire time? Is that what it is? There's a key in there. Live. Time pieces. Sacrifices. So, you sacrifice the things at the roots of the tree. And with the time pieces, it opens the pearly gates. Like, what are we doing? If I. I'm guessing lives what I need to do next. What do you need? To what do you again? need to live again? Sacrifices? If I can remember how to spell. What do you need to open what the do gate? You need to open the gate? Time pieces, apparently. Thank you, Rose. That'd be ever so helpful. The well, part two. Oh, the other half of the well. It's an axe. Um, I, I see we're helping him from the other end this time. Drink, food, wooden stick. Drop it down, bring it back up, and it will probably say food in it. Although I did that in the other order. See, that's the thing. I did that food first, then drink. Um, Refreshing drink. This woman's evil. Um, cup with liquid. He drinks dog pee. <laughs> That's what he drinks after all this time. I love how nobody. I don't. I love how nobody ever looked in the well that he would that like to make sure he wasn't in there. And I'm assuming if I put a worm on the trap, I'll capture a fish. That seems to be how these games work. Yep. And now I need to grill the fish, so I'm assuming I need to put the fish... need to put the stick down, put the fish on the stick, and now I need to make fire. But we can't chop down all of the tree, can we? And there's matches in a plant pot for some reason. Do you too keep your matches in a plant pot at home so you always have matches on hand? And then if I zoom out, zoom back in, I'll have grilled fish. And a wooden stick. I send back down. No. I'm clicking to leave, but I swear, sometimes it doesn't click at the right places. Back up again. I know I'm going to be asking for a stick, aren't I? Good. How did he survive down there for years? Because he is down there for an awful long time. Then we have an offshoot branch, apparently, which is slightly off the side to everything else. Checkmate, Frank and Albert. Just before he has his bath, his potato has three holes in it. I, I think I understand that one. So it's. Uh, well, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, down, up, 
down. Up. Oh. Hey, I got a chest piece. Somebody's going to die here. Cerebrum. Cerebrum. Oh, it's saying the chest piece is in the cerebrum. Uh. They both want each other dead. Why is he turned into a horse? What is going on? Why is it? Does that help? No. I know how horses work, but it won't let me move it. Here's the king, the horse is the horse. Great. What the hell is going on here? Very breaky. Um, there we go. Did I give one of them the knife? Cerebrum. Um, C. E. R. E. B. R. U. Where's the M? It is... Yeah. C... E... R... E... B... R... U... M. Brain, why did what was? Oh, right, the knife was to peel the potato. Apparently, that's all it was for. Guard the brain. And this, I will be the final one for the episode. Then the last dance, and then we'll finish the game in the next one. Sanguis. Ten seconds, ten family members, one rebirth. You want music, and do you want music? You both want music, how wonderful. I'm assuming that's a reset button. Oh, yeah. Uh, that one, that one, that one. I like these kinds of puzzles. They're relatively easy. This one goes over, down, over. This one goes up and over. This one goes over. And sliding blocks. Some sliding block puzzles are absolutely atrocious and should never be touched by human hands. Um, I think I do that and that, which then that one and that one. Do that before I lock myself. Got that, Ned. Um, over, ooh, 
I get it. They go up and round. Can't lock it then. The Vanderboom's family time. Oh, is it that the song they played? Like all together. It is. Great, they're dancing. Am I gonna get anything? giving the ghost a key. That's what I don't get. And then I get a dress and the last suite. That is a very familiar dress. And a very familiar song as well. What is that? Um, right, right, right. Left, right, left, right. Left, left. She says, enough. There's an X on my finger. Do I need to get... Yeah, the needle. The record snapped, apparently. And now I get to stab you? Because that's how this works. Sangrene is blood. I know. Yeah. We're still missing... 1932 in the graveyard. Albert Vanderboom, 1926. Mary. Ida, 1904. Mm. Emma. All the things that represent them. She wants timepiece. Dog gives us bone. Do we put the bone in the hole? I, something tells me there's pieces of the skeleton missing. About place that in. Am I going to make a complete skeleton out of lots of different ones? Can't break into that one. This is a very sad family, what's happened to them. There's a box. Months and days. Okay, I'll do that in a second. Right, so... Uh, the months and days, so months was flour and egg, um, months, oh god, these are Americanized, um, right? No, they, yeah, no, they are British, that's right, um, they're done the right way around, um, 10, 12, so that's 22, 22 and then days of time and hockey mask uh, time so 33 that's an easy combination yes me a piercer used for opening this one and no, no, no scroll over it's very quiet I have noticed it's this one isn't it yeah Oh, there it is. Sounds back. <laughs> and that is the final timepiece. Which means we're going to unlock another one. But I am going to leave that for another episode. Um, because we've been going over half hour already. Um, and this looks like we're about to finish the tree. So maybe it's going to... It shouldn't... It can't be a short episode because there are low because 
despite the fact we appear to be on the final piece of the tree, we have only gotten half of the achievements this game has. So, there must be quite a few more. Um, anyway, I will see you all in the next, uh, next episode, which might be the final one. We'll see. Um, hopefully you going through route so this one hasn't this one definitely like none of the rusty lake games are massively long um but there's definitely a weird story going on in the background